Hi, Alex. I have heard that there may be an energy wave in September. Oh, also heard that many of us may shift into 4D in September. Can you confirm either of these events for September? And if so, are they connected? Well, the energy wave is occurring right now as we speak. Now, whether it's a, a, a more powerful wave or not, I don't have any specific information regarding that. Um, as far as fourth density, some of us moving into 4D, some of us are already um, already have much of ourselves planted in 4D, and what's happening is we're pulling our physicality to it. Okay, I mean, you have to project your consciousness to there first, and then you bring the physicality. Okay, remember it starts with the spirit first, then the physical. Okay, spirit's the original idea, the original intent, and then the physical body follows afterwards. Um, Ryan, it could very well be that here very shortly, as you begin to holographically see the world and think holographically, you will begin to realize, wow, I am now really moving into fourth density because that's the shift. That is one of the major keystones of the shift is the ability to think holographically. And I can't give you any real hard specifics on what that looks like as I myself am also going through this process. But that is the, that's the next stage, okay? That's the next stage is thinking holographically and then physically we begin to move in and out of third and then to fourth. And then at some point, physically our bodies become more light. And what I mean by light is that when we get closer to fifth density, you will be able to travel using your mind pretty much anywhere you want to go. And that's a topic for another webinar. Okay. Um, for those of you who uh, are dream travelers or travel in your dreams, um, who practice the Toltec, Toltec ways, um, you, already, you, already, you already have some experience with this. So that's all I got on that.